Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be giving you guys my desk tour. I'm excited about this video in particular because number one, I finally have my full like aesthetic as to, you know, how I like my desk and my work area to be. And number two, because I love watching these types of videos. So it just makes sense for me to pretty much make one so without further ado let's just get right into the desk tour okay you guys so let's go ahead and get right into the tour so this desk is the ikea alex desk there's only two drawers and um my desk is pretty much divided in two this is my vanity side on the left side and on the right side is my like desk stationary side so this desk was originally blue um <laughs> it was ugly i really wanted the white one but i got it during the whole you know 2020 thing that happened the apocalypse <laughs> so there was no white ones all the white ones were sold out so i decided to give it a go with the contact paper i think i'm kind of like a pro now this is the third time i've contact papered this desk just because um my son he likes to kind of like pick at it so um yeah so now it's like there's like no bubbles it's pretty nice and fresh i got this contact paper from home depot no 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 lowe's 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 has this style i don't know if home depot will this has like um tan beige kind of like a i don't know it kind of looks pink from like far away and i like that but then it kind of looks like like a salmon orange yeah like like burnt orange i don't know but it's really pretty and yeah so i pa painted these white with like regular paint i know there's a certain way to paint over ikea furniture but yeah i was just like i just wanted a quick fix and for the legs the legs were also blue like the whole desk was blue so i spray painted the legs in matte black and i just like it so my desk is under my son's loft bed so it's like a whole little desk nook i have here so it's my area my workspace and so yeah so let's just start off with the top over here these are canvases from joann's i painted these myself my inspiration came from pinterest and what i did was i grabbed a little piece of this i have like leftover contact paper and i took it to the store and that's how i picked out the colors i know i wanted to do like a pop of color my pop of color is this orange like or like burnt orange and since i do have the black accent here and the black accent here it was only right to put black on here so they came out really good i am very impressed with myself um you know some little flaws but i think that's what makes it such an original you know painting that's you know art anyways so i have a coaster here starbucks coffee i have this candle this is my first time having a candle with like this little wooden thing and the sound of it is amazing i don't know if you guys heard that i hope you guys heard that and then behind my candle i have this hidden <laughs> this is my computer charger and my cell phone charger I have it like this because um, so I don't have to like go in there and like pick it up and pull it out so I have it on hand because I don't like when the cords come through here like it's just so hard to like grab and if they fall out I have to re literally remove all of this to open this little flap and yeah it's just a mess so i just have it tucked behind the candle ready to grab easy peasy so um yeah this candle i got from like marshall's and now this side um is still this is all still my vanity side 
I have my perfume, I have my brushes, and I have my makeup palettes and some jewelry. And I love how simple it looks. And I love the clear acrylic containers because you just see through it and it just looks so like you know minimalistic and you know it's just the cl I, I don't like clutter also i had to figure out a way to put this out here because it doesn't fit in the drawers in here so i'll show you guys guys that next um so i got questions about this on tiktok last time so i'll show you guys these are these are not the makeup brushes these are actually well at the container store these are the like the bathroom like toothbrush holders i believe so they're a little bit taller and bigger so that's why i grabbed these instead of the actual makeup brush holders that they have labeled at the container stores all of my acrylic containers are from the container store so okay this i made while playing around with like the organization of my desk i ended up this is pretty much a magazine holder or you know like when you stack your papers like that this is what the original thing is but since i was playing around with it and i really you know have an issue with space in my home and in my room um this ended up working out the most because then i can have some height here put that up there and i made it like a open shelf type of situation and it works very lovely and then i was also able to put you know all of my granted i had to <laughs> get rid of one palette but i really wasn't using that palette so and it was destroyed so i didn't really care so yeah so and i love how like these colors of my palette since i'm kind of more like neutral when it comes to like doing my makeup i do like a pop of color sometimes but that's what you know one of them has it it just kind of goes with the contact paper so moving on over here i have my lamp and then i spray painted this matte black this was like silver and this actually was like a clear acrylic but i think the black accent just goes because my curtain rods um are black as well so you know i have a little certain black accents in my room and it just flows i have my skincare up here because number one space number two it re helps remind me to do my skincare <laughs> and um my vanity mirror is from Ulta, it's just touch, super cute. You can hold it down and then, yeah. I love how this is acrylic and it just kind of goes with everything. So I like the flow of everything. Everything's mostly like black, white, neutrals, pop of color. And now in here, like I said, all of my containers are from the container store. So I don't have a big makeup, um, let's say collection i just have what works for me and how like my lifestyle and i don't really use a lot of makeup but when i do wear makeup like you know i do a full beat <laughs> sometimes just go natural and everything fits here so i have my tools here tweezers no file curling um eyelash curler i have my creams and powders here and then i have my lipsticks mascara here chapstick lip liners and then these little cotton pads i use these for my toners my skincare and then my sponges we have my blushes and my highlighters my makeup remover and this little slot right here this is the little like kind of medicine type of thing like you know pimple gel um some other stuff and then um this is also for uh pimple stuff and then <laughs> this is a birth control and then right here i have this was like the perfect size for all of these little clips and hair ties rubber bands and yeah and i love that this holds both my brushes like this they just they're not flying everywhere so i love that okay so moving on to the right side to basically my stationary more desk office uh situation here i love this like 
I'm so happy. This was my inspiration actually to have orange because I was thinking, hmm, the room itself, like my bed sheets and stuff, since I'm with my man and my son, it's more like blue. It's like neutral and blue. So um, this blue with the orange, I was like, oh, orange is gonna be the color then. You know, no pink, no, um, no red, so it worked out. So I was using this, um, this acrylic um, organizer drawer is from Ross. I got it a long time ago. I used to store my makeup in this, but, um, and then I had like a little makeup thing like on top too, and it just kind of looked like a mess. I love how this looks. It just looks so clean, so organized and clear. <laughs> right here I have my pens and mechanical pencils. Right here I have my highlighters, and then right here I have, um, my tools and stuff stapler tape glue um little um task things and this scissor i love so oh also orange is kind of like very close to gold so yeah so it just kind of flowed like my inspiration was gold and acrylic so it just worked out this scissor is from the container store and um, yeah, what else do I have here? Oh, my technology stuff, you know, just chargers, the charger for my camera, I'm using my camera right now, my AirPods, and then my camera goes here. And right here I have on hand all the journals that I actually use. So I have a bookshelf, but this is what I use like on a day-to-day -day basis. This is like my YouTube ideas and goals. This is, um, my devotional this is my journal where you know i just journal my thoughts and this is my bible this my friend gabriel gave it to me for christmas and i love harry potter i'm obsessed and it just goes like the colors from there the browns and the beiges and tans moving on to the drawer as the desk i have my planner here I have extra like markers and pencils. This is like kind of like back stock. And then, oh, my cosmetology license here. Oh shoot, why did I pull that out? <laughs> this is Sebastian's when he does his zoom thing. This is, um, he puts has to put on his finger to like raise his hand, super cute, I love that. And then um, this is kind of like where I do like my budgeting. I don't want to show you guys personally. <laughs> what i have on there but i do want to show you this cute there you go <laughs> i took the papers off so this is from the container store i love this like man i just love the acrylic aesthetic with the gold it's just fire so yeah so i have this in here and then i love that you can like see through it once you um put the papers on well i'm just putting in there <laughs> messily and then right here i do want to get another long acrylic organizer and um these are like loose papers things i need to get to kind of like inbox or things i need to mail out and yeah and then i have like a extra charger there's nothing back there this is for my computer stuff my um hdmi um memory stuff and then I have my calculator here because I do all of my family's budgeting. So I work with a lot of numbers. Um, I do want to get like a cute, more like white acrylic, aesthetically pleasing uh, calculator. Because this one's just like black, like old school geometry as calculator. <laughs> and then I have this container is also from the container store. And right here I have my lighter for the candle and then these are like receipts that I need on hand just in case I like return anything or need to return anything. These things are to wipe down my computer, my mirror, and I have a whole bunch of keys and little knickknacks and stuff. So yeah, that is my desk. So there you guys have it. That is my desk tour, my vanity slash desk 
area workspace area i hope you guys enjoyed this and i'll see you guys next time thank you for watching bye